let's begin winding up for the day and what remarkable resilience we're actually closing in at the session highs didn't quite make it back to the green but almost there only 67 points lower and i say only because of uh, the way the global uh, markets have been panning out remember the u.s futures are still indicating a downtick for us nvidia is still down about two percent in the pre-markets and uh, we all know what happened to the Asian screen, or for that matter, how Europe as well has kick-started the day. Of course, the you know sore losers today have been metal, technology, some of the power as well as the banking names as well have been laggards. ONGC fell a good three and a quarter percent. MNM, Hindarco, LTIM, Infosys, SBI, they've all been ranked underperformers. On the flip side, sectorally, FMCG, Cement and Pharma they have been uh, the ones which have been the big winners today. Uh, of course, you know, gains were uh, quite elevated when it came to some of the OMCs. HPBP both held out smartly. Bicon lapped up about 4.5% in trade. Granules held out very smartly, a good 2.5% uptick there. And paints as a segment is where you saw most meaty gains. So everything from a Berger to an Asian Paints, all those stocks held out very, very smartly. On the losing side, uh, there was Startup Power also, which fell about three and a quarter percent or so. Uh, a BHL, RBL Bank, they have been some of the big laggards in trade. But really the flip has happened thanks to Kotak, Bajaj Finserv, HDFC Bank and Reliance Industries. But that's that on this edition of Closing Trades. It's a goodbye from Anisha and me and we'll see you again tomorrow morning. If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to ET Now.